Devotion. Higher level spells may prove more potent and of greater assistance to your party. Expert spirit magic can be yours if you have a skill level of four in spirit magic and can pay the price of 1,000 gold. There we go. Mr. Who taught me Heather Dreamwork makes our home in Arathia somewhere in the capital city of Stidwick. Further knowledge of spirit magic can be gained there. I hope I'm not offending anybody with my stereotypes. Mind magic and mastery. You have to be promoted to priest of light or priest of dark to learn the skill level. Great. Tywork Caverns. Was that about Tywork Caverns? Pirates. Pirates have been operating out of the Tidewater Caverns for 20 years. They're not Regnans, and they aren't part of Velasca's men, but they're still pretty mean. If you want to get in there, just get yourself out to the islands to the west. So I guess it means we can head out into the water. Yeah, we can. If we had water walking, and we do, we could head out and fight ourselves some pirates, but I don't feel in the mood for that right now. Right now, I'm more interested in establishing ourselves as Lords of Harmondale. Ah, uh, here come we are. Come in, come in! A loyal mercenary. Uh, greater juxtaposition on words have ne has never been heard before. And floor packs. Right away! And let's see what else skills we can get out here. Nothing. Let's play Acromage instead. Archimage, excuse me. Ah, dun da. I shouldn't have gone for destroying my own tower so early in the game. You begin with a small tower, big wall, and. I notice that the game lags the more cards there are on screen up here. So I'm gonna try to worry, not worry about <coughs> Excuse me. Looks like the tower goal is pretty steep, so it might be worth it more to get a resource victory or something. Looks like the goal for a tower is probably a hundred something, I'm not quite sure. Oops, we should have gone for the crystal mix. Wow. Playing that to get all those cards off the screen. Uh, innovations? Nah. Goblin mob! I'm not gonna play parody. I'm never gonna play parody. Oops. So that's what you can do to skip a turn. If you right-click on a card, it discards it. Huh, never knew that. Should have discarded parody. Oh well. Sanctuary. Sanctuary. And I'm going to take the turn out to just discard parody. Nerf his beasts. Plus 20 to my tower. Aha. Maybe I will go for a tower victory. I seem to have a commanding lead over him. Because upheaval is ever so much fun. If he ever gets a dragon heart, I'm pretty screwed because he has a ton of bricks. Dun dun. Building up my tower, building up my tower. Ah, 
Great Wall. Try not. Lodestone. It's kind of funny because Lodestone is pretty much a card that is kind of like a cursed item. You can't discard it, so you just have to play it to get rid of it. Collapsing his deck. Ha ha. He ninjaed most of my gear. And I think I should be able to win it. It looks like the goal is about 150 in tower, but we'll find out real quick here. Tower, which is quite impressive. Oh no, he played parody. You jerk. Oh, there goes my commanding queen. Unfortunately, it takes him a while to build up his gems. I can build my tower up. And yay, there we go. 125 tower. I won, and I won 2,000 gold. Alright. After that brief but intense game of Acromage, I'm saving my game, and I'll be right back, folks. Thank you all for watching.